Usually say visitors draws for the wide barriers, but Chris Lee's local trainer, he's got the outside two marbles here with his charges, Cleveland and Carlapore. Who completes the line. Cupfield ready to be released. Set. They stand. Allegron just marking time. Now they're right to the roar of the crowd. They're off and racing in the Newcastle Cup and Carla Paws immediately restrained. So too is Cleveland and Spirit Ridge. He got a great start. If the Knights start like that this weekend, you'll be happy. Look at him go, Spirit Ridge. Down to the winning post, around to go. He's going to cross them. Leading from Hosier, sliding forward. Wineglass Bay about to get into a great spot with cover fourth, the outside. He's on the outside of Sir Lucan. Gear up was next as they go over the crossing. Then Desert Icon. Followed by Military Mission. Getting back was Parry Sound. Allegron, Raging Bull, three wide. Torrens the inside. Boardagent between runners, three or four lengths away. Then to Bonnie Ezra on the inside of Outlandos. And the Chris Lees pair, one, two at the back of the field. That's Cleveland and Carlapur, who's last on the inside. And he'd be 16 lengths off the lead. Which into the back straight is Spirit Ridge. He's got the ears pricked, enjoying his work here in the cup. 1,400 metres to go. He's one and a half in front of Hosier for Mark Minavini. He's parked in second spot. The other local behind those horses, Sir Lucan. He's enjoying a great run on the fence, followed by Wineglass Bay for Karen McAvoy. Behind those then was Desert Icon in a stretched out field. Gear up centre field. Behind those was Parry Sound Military Mission as they race in pairs. Now Raging Bull's been able to get one off the outside of Allegron. Then Torrens, he's being covered up by the grey galloper, Boada Jeanne. Further back was Outlandos in company there with Bonnie Ezra. Cleveland and Carla Poor still at the back of the field. Spirit Ridge has got them stretched out over plenty of territory here. He brings them down the side to Spirit Ridge. One length in front of Hosier travelling strongly. Sir Lucan pops three deep before the turn. Then Wineglass Bay's had a sweet trip. Back behind those Desert Icon military mission. Where are these favourites? Carla Poor's last defence as they come for home. 4.25 to run. Spirit Ridge led Hosier. To the outside, Sir Luke and Wineglass Bay presents. Then Desert Icon Military Mission is running home. It's coming down the outside with Bois d'Argent. Carla Poor still a long way back, 200 metres to go. Spirit Ridge, Hosier, Military Mission, Desert Icon. Wineglass Bay boxes on, 100 to go. He's game, Spirit Ridge. Hosier, Military Mission, they come. They come hard. And Military Mission got him right on the line. Military Mission has got up and won the Newcastle Cup from Spirit Ridge. Third, Hosier. He was gallant, fourth a photo. Wide out, Bois de Jeanne, Wineglass Bay, then Cleveland, followed by the next home, Sir Lucan, Bonnie Ezra. Well back was Allegron, Raging Bull, Parry Sound and Torrens, Outlandos, Gear Up. And where's Carlapore? I didn't call him over the line. Has he finished about midfield or so? Military Mission has gone up and won. Rachel King for Gay Waterhouse and Adrian Bott. The inform stable in Australia at the moment. Gay and Adrian absolutely flying. And he's worn them down, his military mission to get there and salute by a neck on the line. Spirit Ridge has led everywhere by the last 20 metres. Hosier, Desert Icon behind them. Interim numbers 14, 11, 8 and 9. A neck by half a length. In 122.40, last 600, pretty good for the end of 2300. No wonder those back markers couldn't quite get into it. Winners come from a shade better than midfield, but 34.09. Military mission. Has won the Newcastle Cup. What price was he? 18.60 and 5.30.